Hello students good morning in today's session we are here to learn social science unit 4 atmosphere before getting into today's topic let us recollect our previous classes we have learnt about the realms of the earth weather and climate about atmosphere composition of air atmospheric layers solar radiation and finally elements of climate in this elements of climate we have learnt temperature pressure and different types of wind in today's session we are here to see the remaining elements of climate that is different types of clouds and rainfall yes our today's topic is different types of clouds and rainfall clouds what are clouds clouds are large collection of very tiny droplets of water i repeat it clouds are large collection of very tiny droplets of water that is clouds are made up of water drops or ice crystals floating in the sky clouds are made up of water drops or ice crystals floating in the sky there are four different types of clouds they are cirrus clouds stratus clouds cumulus clouds and nimbus clouds at first let's learn about cirrus clouds cirrus clouds look like a silvery gray fish which is at very high altitude that is which is very high in level in the sky these may not give any rainfall to the earth next let's know about stratus clouds stratus clouds which are gray in color and it spreads throughout the sky This stratus clouds gives only small shower of rain. Next one is cumulus clouds. Cumulus clouds look like a puffy white cotton which gives convectional rainfall. These cumulus clouds are associated with rainfall lightning and thunder next one is nimbus clouds nimbus clouds are very dark or gray in color it gives very heavy rainfall nimbus clouds are also called as vertical clouds or rain clouds so nimbus clouds it looks very dark or gray in color which gives very heavy rainfall and it is also called as vertical clouds or rain clouds so cirrus clouds stratus clouds cumulus clouds and nimbus clouds are the different types of clouds next Let's learn about rainfall. What is rainfall? Condensation of water vapor causes rainfall. Condensation. The meaning of condensation is the process of changing gas into liquid. So, rainfall is caused by condensation of water vapor which forms droplets of water 
that falls from the clouds due to its gravity causes rainfall rain water must be saved through rain water harvesting and it should not be wasted types of rainfall there are three types of rainfall they are convectional rainfall orographic rainfall and cyclonic rainfall convectional rainfall during summer solar insulation takes place in land and water evaporates from lakes ponds and vegetation that is during summer solar insulation takes place that is solar radiation or the exposure of sun rays takes place in land and so the water from the pond lake and vegetation gets evaporates due to this solar insulation a heavy rainfall occurs with lightning and thunder in the evening for a short period of time this is called convectional rainfall next one is orographic rainfall when the moisture laden winds from the sea rises as it moves over a mountain range it becomes cool and causes heavy rainfall the moisture laden winds that is wind from the sea contains a lot of moisture it rises and moves over the mountain and it becomes very cool and causes heavy rainfall the next point is the opposite side of the mountain is called leeward side it receives very little rainfall that is the opposite side of the mountain is called leeward side the leeward side receives very little rainfall whereas the side which receives heavy rainfall is called windward side the next one is cyclonic rainfall rainfall occurs through cyclones or storms are called cyclonic rainfall when the warm air from the hot region gets heated the air moves upwards when the air moves upwards low pressure is developed in that region so this low pressure attracts air from high pressure area because of the pressure difference and due to the earth's rotation a circular motion of wind is developed it is called cyclone it gets cool and brings heavy rainfall and finally we are going to learn about rainwater harvesting what is rainwater harvesting it is a technique of collecting and storing rainwater into natural reservoirs or tanks or the infiltration of surface water into subsurface aquifers rainwaters can be stored into a natural reservoir like pond or lake or well it can also be stored through the infiltration of surface water into subsurface aquifers that is it is a process by which water on the ground surface enters into the soil so that the rain water cannot get wasted in the land the best method of rain water harvesting is rooftop harvesting 
students hope you are clear with today's session have a good day thank you